Hello, all you beautiful people out there. My name is Jack Septicai, and welcome back to Don't Starve, where I have been busy since you last saw me. I recorded a a bunch of footage of me setting up this camp, but of course, YouTube didn't want to upload it for me. It just said, "Nope, not gonna do that. Sorry." So, I have got a lot done. This little mandrake, I picked him up, and he followed me the whole way back to my camp, and I didn't like it, because he is so loud. He kept just going, meow, 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 over and over and over. But anyway, yeah, I'm here in my little camp. I got a crockpot set up, alchemy engine, science machine, the whole shebang. Crockpot is awesome. You get to cook food much, much easier with it. You can basically like load a bunch of stuff up into it and then just let it off. I got my little bushes here, my dude, I'm gonna dig all these and plant them near. Ah, screw you bird, you took my grass. I needed that grass. I've also been playing another version of this, well not another version, but just playing as Wolfgang, or Mustachio, as you guys wanted me to call him. I was playing as him on another kind of profile, just to try and get myself a bit better at the game, and I did! I got a lot better, but I can't remember what is happening on this save, so... I'm just gonna try and play it by ear. Basically, what I'm doing is setting up for winter. Winter is gonna come, and it's gonna kick my ass again, so... Setting up as best I can. Need to make more traps. Just traps, traps, traps. Traps are the order of the day. Traps are king. Traps are just what you want to plant everywhere. And get up your meat. Because if you put four cooked meat into a crock pot, you get meatballs. And meatballs are awesome. Hello bees. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna attack you because you're nice. And you don't attack me unprovoked. Unlike a great deal of other stuff in this bloody game. Did I make another trap that time? I did. Here we go. Set it there. Okay. I might make another crock pot. For a crock pot you need like loads of charcoal, so... I planted a bunch of trees. I don't need to fertil- I need to fertilize this one. This is my grass that I have planted. You take a grass tuft, and you right click, and you just plant, plant, plant. But what I need to plant are a bunch more saplings like this. There's a grass suit. I didn't bother picking up the grass suit because I don't really need it. I'm not going fighting anything yet. I'm just trying to save my ass for now. And once you build up like a farm near where you settle, you basically, you don't really have to wander out too often and that's where it comes in handy for winter. Because when winter comes, you can't go very far for very long. Otherwise, you're just gonna freeze to death without the proper equipment, so... Digging up all this stuff and planting it near your home means that you get to use all this stuff when it, like... I wouldn't say comes ripe, but when it grows properly. I think saplings take like six days to grow. I'm not sure what way they work. You look like a tree guard. No, go away, go away, go away! No, 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 I told... I press space for you to pick up the fucking stick, not to attack them. Leave the spiders alone. Spiders are bad. Stop following me, spider. Thank you. Yeah, there we go. Pick up all this. Twigs are handy, because twigs basically build everything. I have enough for another garland, so I'm just going to keep them for now. And yeah, when I got to the place that I'm settled in now, I, there was a chest outside. Uh, I wish the footage would actually upload. I might try it again at another time, but right now it just won't. YouTube, it gets, it processes, it uploads and everything, it gets to 95% processing and then it just says failed, so... I don't know what's up with that. But when I got to the fort, there was a chest there, right beside, out, just outside it, like there always is, and I said, Oh, I wonder what's inside this, and then... It turns out there was a fire staff inside it, and it burnt the entire fort to the ground. Which sucked! Oh, I have a bunch more traps set up here, what am I talking about? I forgot all about these. 
Hello, rabbits. God, I have a lot of meat to pick up here. Awesome. Actually, not that awesome, because now I don't have enough room for them. Hmm. Is there anything I can drop or plant or something? Mm, not yet. It's okay. Keep those guys into traps for now. I'll head back to my camp and cook these guys up. I'll show you how the crock pot works. Is there like a path that I can take easily? Yeah, this one over here. I tried to settle near a place where the path... It's always good. If you can find beefalo that are near a path like this, then set up your camp like right beside that path. Because it just it makes things so much easier to get around. I'll plant all these dudes around here. I like to have them set up aesthetically pleasing. As best as possible. Look at that, my little my little crops. Yeah, nighttime's coming. Hmm. I have another sapling. I'm gonna plant this instead of taking up room in my inventory. Grass tufts. These things that I dig up to plant, these things are awesome for fires. Watch this. Look how much that brings up that fire. Yeah, but you can't put rabbits straight into a crock pot. That's what I was trying to do the first time. I went after the crock pot and I was thinking, why won't the rabbits just go into that? I want to cook them. But no, you need to cook them here first. You can't put anything raw in. And then you go up and you put into the crock pot. Boy, three in it already. You put four in, and then you hit cook. And it cooks away, and you wait. Hmm, what do I need to build? What do I want to build? I want to build a chest, I think. I need three more boards. God, I have no logs. I guess that's what I gotta do. I want a chest here so I can just keep myself. And now look, my meatballs are ready. It takes almost no time to cook at all. And watch, watch my thing, my food, when I eat this. Boom! Look how much that went up. That's why crock pots are the shit. They bring your stuff up way more. And I want to build another one because while that's cooking, you can't cook anything else in it, so... I want to build another one and kind of get two foods going. If you put a lot of vegetables in, you get ratatouille. Ratatouille. Ratatouille, as it looks like. Which, if any of you have eaten, it's just like a, a vegetable medley. But it is delicious. I want to build a little farm, too, so I can plant some seeds. That's why my farm wasn't working before. I was looking at the farm going, why isn't it yielding any crops? But you need to, like, actually plant stuff in the farm. God, get back to camp. Get back to camp. Go, 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 go. I don't have enough for a damn torch. Go, go. Oh, yeah, just in time. That was lucky. Whew. What can I... I'm just gonna cook these dudes. Free up all that space in my inventory. Because when you have all these rabbits, they all take up an individual space. So cooking them brings them down into that. And they don't they don't wear down that fast. Like, they don't um, go bad that fast. You can't do that. Why? I'm planting all these near each other because I have to burn them to get charcoal. And when you burn then they all kind of set each other on fire, so you can burn one instead of burning them all, individually. Okay, so I gotta build a chest, and then I want to make some opulent stuff, but I don't know where there's a lot of rocks. Gotta head back this way. Oh, uh, there's, there's a lot of rocks up here. I'll mine a lot of gold up there afterwards. When you make opulent stuff, it's, it's basically gold. It's gold-like tools, in other words, and they are awesome. They last so much longer. Hmm, let's head out. I'm not going through wormholes ever again, because it just makes you go crazy, and I can't afford to go crazy. I want to keep my guy's sanity up as much as possible. Okay, so I need a lot of wood to make some boards to make a chest, so I can keep a lot more stuff back in my camp. Hmm. And then I want to build a farm. So chest and farm. What do I need for my farm? I can't check now because I'm not back there. 
Oh man. Pull another axe. There we go. Chop, choppy, choppy, dude, chop. I haven't come across a tree guard in a long time, and that's really good. I love when tree guards don't attack me. It just, it makes me feel happy. Chop, chop, chop. I also was told that making a beefalo hat is good for winter. Because it's very warm. And also you can make, like, hot stones, which are basically just stones that you heat up. But you can build them and you can put them in your inventory and they keep you warm. Head back here. Oh, I can refine boards from here. What am I doing? I have four now. That should be enough. Not gonna wander too far from my camp today. The next day is when I'll head out and get all my my gold. I wanted to build a chest. I believe the chest next to the fire to keep all my stuff just in the one place. What can I put in here for now? I'll put my fire staff because I don't need it. Put my pine cones because I'm going to plant them around here. Put one flint because I have a bunch here. Put one more board and I'll put a lot. I'll put grass tufts in there because I'm not going to use them out in the road and I will use them here for burning. And my cut stone. Now, what did I say I wanted? I wanted a farm. Mm, no. Improved farm. I need 10 grass, 3 more poops, and 4 more rocks. God, I do need to go near rocks. Okay. Let's head to get rocks first, because there's a lot of grass around here. I don't need grass. I get those traps on the way back, and all the poop is around here as well, so... I can do all that stuff when I get back here, rather than... when I'm doing it on the way, because I'll run out of time. So whatever you can get easiest, get it last. Whatever is the hardest to get, get that first. I'm gonna go over here because there's a path over here near the rocks. <sighs> I think the reason my video didn't upload before was because it was too long. And YouTube kinda, it doesn't handle really long videos that well if your internet connection is not good. Because it has to process for a long time, I guess to 95% processing. And then it... It kind of glitches when it does that. It's not actually processing properly. And then when you get to the proper processing, if your internet connection is not fast enough and it doesn't process in time, it'll basically say, no, not going to do it. So when the videos are too long, it kind of... I don't know, it's not good. It's hard to explain. I'm sure some of you know what I mean, though. So I'm going to try and keep the videos short-ish. I think I'll just go back to my regular two nights. But this video is now in 1080p because I uploaded videos recently and a lot of people fucking hated them. I got like a bunch of thumbs down like in such a short amount of time and it was so disheartening. But it was for Metro so that's kind of a graphic intensive game. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna keep the quality high. People react good to high quality videos. But anything you want me to do to my videos to make them better, please let me know. I try to upload a bunch of videos as fast as I can, and sometimes it's probably not the best idea. I should probably go for quality rather than quantity. But in this day and age, I need a lot more quantity first, because... People... If I have a lot of videos up online, then people are gonna stumble upon my videos first and foremost before somebody else's. Like, if I just flood flood YouTube with videos of Don't Starve, then it might work out in my favor. Rather than spending a whole bunch of time making one video really high quality and then, like, not getting anyone to watch it. You know what I mean. I don't know if I got enough stuff for this, but it's getting late, so I gotta head back. Ooh, berries. I'm not gonna pick them. Oh, yeah, I got my touchstone over here, so I'm... I'm good for that. But I'm gonna head back to my camp for now. I don't have a lot of time. I needed 10 grass, didn't I? I have 14, I'm okay. Can't remember how much cut stone I needed. I needed 6 poops. I really should remember these things rather than just guessing. Hmm, I'm down here. Oh yeah, and I wanted to pick up all these on the way back. 
Come, little rabbits. I have four now, so I can make another meatball. If you kill a beefalo as well, you get meat. You get, like, proper meat on a bone. And it turns into, like, a meaty stew. I'm gonna make another garland because my petals are going stale. So it's better to have a full, proper garland. And drop that over there. Cool. I can't put the garland on the fire. Why is that? That sucks. Grass tuft on the fire. Get out of my camp, you damn birds. Shoot! Shoot! Okay, farm time. No, I keep getting mixed up. You'd think the farm would be under structures. Improved farm. I need an alchemy engine for it. Here we go. Stick that over here near all my plants. There we go, and then I plant a seed right in the middle of it. And that's gonna grow. Now I have you, I have you, cook you, cook you, and put you two in here. Awesome. And then that will be ready in a matter of seconds. Cook these, because it's always nice to have seeds. I keep one seeds. Just in for that. And cooked. Time to eat these. And full again. And that is it for this bout of Don't Starve. I hope you guys learned a lot or saw a lot. You saw Crockpot, Alchemy Engine, and Science Machine all in full swing. You saw me plant all my stuff. You know what kind of setup I'm running now. I'm really settled down here. And I'm getting ready for winter. Me and Mustachio are gonna outlast this shit. So thank you for watching. If you like the video, hit the little likey button. It really helps me a lot. If you like the Don't Star videos, subscribe because I will definitely continue doing more. But thank you for watching, and I will see all you dudes in the next video.